This video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer. The one and only ape father at Long Beach Island, baby. Wow! There it is. The one and only Wonder Wheel. I'm taking the kids to the uh, arcade. Have a little fun. Family fun, baby. So, I just want to say... I am not selling my AMC to all of the AMC apes who are now mad at me. It's just that it's common sense. You understand? AMC, Sophia, honey, just stay with mommy. She's like running off without her mother. She's excited. AMC, unfortunately, you have to try to understand. I have my life savings. I have 3,400 shares of AMC. It's not doing anything because, honestly, our management sucks. You can't be upset at me. You have, you know you really should be upset at? You should be upset at Adam, Aaron, and the insiders. Because you know what it is? They're selling. They don't care about you. You think they care about you? You think Adam, Aaron cares about you? The guy's drinking Johnny Walker Blue. It's because of him we saved his company. He sold very high. From what I understand, he sold at the top. I think he was actually one of the reasons why AMC didn't squeeze when it was like at 72 because of Adam uh, Aaron because he sold. Okay, then he sold again in the 40 range and in the 30 range. All the AMC insiders are selling. There's no, he's not doing a good job. There's no catalyst. You know, I told, I told him all that money, that war chest money, he should be putting that into some sort, you know, of a competition with Netflix, some sort of streaming, a competition with Disney. What is he putting it into? Popcorn and gold. The guy is doing a terrible job. He's he's horrible. I'm sorry, but that's the bottom line. And now Ryan Cohen, right? And GameStop is a whole different deal. He's real, Ryan Cohen. Guy's got 9.1 million shares of GameStop. You know, everything fundamentally is amazing with GameStop. Okay, it's a great company that has a bright future. They're going into the NFT marketplace in a big way. They got partnerships going on. They have everything, loop ring. It's just, there's just so much excitement. Okay, there's, unfortunately, AMC, there's no excitement. There's no momentum. And the good thing is this, because a lot of apes, both in AMC and GameStop, they own both plays. This is what I'm trying to make you both understand. They, you know, when I say both, they mean my brother and my sister apes. Listen to me very carefully. If you, buy, if you own AMC, I'm not telling you to sell it. Okay, I never said that. I never said get out of AMC and get into GameStop. I said hold the current AMC shares that you have. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hold my 3,400 shares. But don't buy anymore because it's a waste of time. All that's going to happen, you're going to buy, and, and, and especially if you're buying on Robinhood, and if you're buying on, like, Weeble, come on. It's going right into the dark pools. Ken Griffin is getting richer. And, and I have a feeling that's what majority of AMC apes are doing. You're buying on payment for order flow platforms. You won't admit it to me, but that's what you're doing, okay? So why not buy GameStop that has a catalyst, fundamentally is awesome, it's going to go up, and it's going to make AMC go up. AMC will take a piggyback ride on GameStop's success. It's just logical. And, and what difference does it make how AMC Moaz is? Like, I mean, it's like now it's getting to a point where I feel like you're all like particular of how you want AMC to squeeze. What's the difference? Like I said, I gave the analogy. What's the difference if Santa Claus makes AMC squeeze? What's the difference if the Easter Bunny makes AMC squeeze? What's the difference if Boy George, do you really want to hurt me do you really want to make amc go down no you don't you want amc to go up right okay so gamestop and ryan cohen are going to help us they're going to help amc go up gabish it's common sense like the common sense investor. So stop taking things so personally. I have your best interest at heart. I love AMC and I love my AMC apes, but let me understand. I don't love AMC management. I don't love Adam, you know, Aaron. I don't love the insiders that are selling. I hate those guys, they're chumps. You hear me, Adam, Aaron? You're a chump and the insiders are chumps. I love the AMC apes, the retail investors. You're my brothers and sisters for life and I would never steer you in the wrong direction. Buying GameStop will ultimately help two Moazes, GameStop and AMC. You'll see that I am going to be proven right. But remember, I'm not a financial advisor. I don't give financial advice. I'm an entertainer, baby. Shout out to Marantz Rance, who just posted me on uh, Twitter, by the way. 
I just got a, a text. I don't know if there was silence. Shout out to Marantz Rants, who just put me on Twitter. Wel welcomed me to the GameStop family. Thank you. I love you, brother. I love my GameStop brothers and sisters, and I love my AMC brother and sisters. I love both of us. Okay? It takes two to make a thing go right. It takes two to make it out of sight. Remember that.